I knew Leftover Crack's name long before I heard their music. You can't forget a name like that. <laughs> So I guess Alec was like 17 or 18 when I met him and Sturgeon was 15 or 16 and really no different. Like Sturgeon at that time, I never really gave him the time of day because I always thought he was sort of impish, you know? I was like, ah, you know, Sturgeon, you know what I mean? Like, he's always just sort of joking around. It wasn't until a few years later, you know, once I started playing with him on Leftover Crack, that I, I understood his talent and the seriousness of his his intent. Uh, I would get cassette tapes of like, hey, I've been making these, I've been writing these songs in Montana, and, and I'm starting this band called Lift Over Crack, and you want to play guitar? And I was like, yeah, sure, you know. In some ways, Leftover Crack is the most controversial artist we've had in a long, long time. This next song is about killing cops, because we fucking hate cops. Huh. Nah, I never wanted to be a cop. They always terrified me when I was little. But it's just because it says kill cops on my fingers, and we were singing about killing cops, and went like that. And they were like, they were, they were saying they banned us because uh, that was the World Trade Center, and I was, that was it falling down, which is totally stupid. I totally didn't mean that by doing that, but... But I didn't, you know... I'm not going to say that I was against the World Trade Center falling down. What we have back here is a dramatic recreation of the World Trade Center. Rendered in paper mache, we really care. We really care about World Trade and the victims of World Trade. Gonna be a god of the loud tooth out in my head. Uh, I think we're more suicidal than homicidal, you know? <laughs> uh, not into killing other people as much as I'm into killing myself. Well, uh, m more than one member of the band has talked to me about mental and physical survival because Sturgeon being somebody that a lot of people look up to, that brings a hell of a lot of pressure, too. I mean, I don't think he really wants to be hero, per se, but to a lot of people he is and he knows that and Sometimes it means he has trouble pulling back from that if he feels like he wants to pull his life more together. But when we're playing to people that are singing along, I mean, there's nothing better, really, honestly. I mean, uh, you know, and those are great songs, so they're always fun to play. You know, they're good sing-along choruses about things that, you know, Sturgeon and I and almost everyone in the band has gone through, you know. It's my life, it's our lives, you know what I'm saying? And that's what we sing about.
again to hear.